And we get to this guy, who's Alberto Alessina, who, just like Joseph Schumpeter, is arguing for emetic economics, and he too is the head of the economics department at Harvard. He's the guy who came up with called the expansionary austerity hypothesis. It's about debt and time inconsistency, which is actually that Ricardian equivalent stuff all again. And it basically says the following. This is the confidence fairy thing. This is why you cut spending, right? So imagine the economy's fallen around your ears. You don't know if you're going to have a job tomorrow. Your partner's already unemployed. You really don't know about the future, but you really worry about the debt. You just lie awake all night worrying about the debt, as people do. So the government credibly signals that it's going to massively cut government expenditure. And what you do using your rational expectations that are built into your head, where you know this true structural form of the equation governing the economy and the value of the coefficients therein, big assumption, but put that to one side, you calculate your lifetime budget and your lifetime expenditure in relation to the fact that 20 years from now, because of these state spending cuts now, you'll pay less taxes then. Thereby, you can retrodict how much extra money you've got now, and everybody goes to Ikea and buys a couch, and that cures the recession. I am not making this shit up. Take away all the math, that's what all these papers say. 